Hey there, folks. Uh, my name is Dante Macaluso, and I am the coordinator of youth ministry here at St. Patrick Parish. I think first and foremost, just the community that has been able to be built around our youth ministry program has been just awesome to see uh, different kids um, coming back this year who maybe were a part of our program in some capacity last year. They come back and they, they know friends from youth ministry and um, they say hi and they get together and right away they're off like chit-chatting and playing games. So it's just awesome to see the different friendships that are made through the kids that are part of our program regularly. Um, and also just new friendships being created as well. Um, kids that are for the first time coming to our program, to our youth nights. When it comes to our high schoolers that are part of our high school uh, youth nights that, that meet on Sundays, um, it's really awesome to see how their faith has developed as they get older. Um, we have a lot of kids in our program who are just really on fire for the faith and want to know more or maybe like have questions or, or are curious. And it's just great to see them being willing to offer those questions and, and dive a little deeper and, and want to know more. It's just really cool to see kids getting out of their comfort zone um, in the name of getting to know Christ in some deeper way. Um, and I'm, I'm really glad that um, our program gets to provide them that opportunity to go a little deeper. We have kids in our program, middle schoolers and high schoolers, who uh, need to receive their first communion and their first reconciliation. Um, in addition to maybe even confirmation. And uh, uh, we have kind of a specific program for them. It's just great to see these kids be able to enter into these sacraments. Um, but it's, it's almost even better to see the parents' reaction. Um, we had the opportunity to um, have first confession, first reconciliation um, for several kids as a part of our program who are in middle school and in high school. I kind of overheard one uh, one set of kids leaving the youth night and going to their parents car um, after it was over and they had kind of received that sacrament for the first time and I just heard them all just like yell in congratulations <laughs> like in joy of like yes like we did it like good job and that was just really uh, great to see the opportunity for a family to come together and, and gather around in support of like you are growing in this like faith journey. Our adult leaders do an amazing job every week with our kids. These are amazing adults um, who come from a lot of different backgrounds, um, different places in their faith journeys, different experiences. Um, but regardless of all of that, they come together as a community um, to try to accomplish this, mi this mission together, uh, to walk with our youth um, and to, to point them in the right direction. It's just great to see how our leaders are sometimes even challenged in their faith to, to know more and to grow more because of the conversations that they're having with students on a weekly basis. I've loved being youth minister here at St. Patrick Parish. Um, and it's not just because I get to see the kids grow in their faith every week. Um, it's not just because I get to experience the community that's being built here, whether that's amongst the students or amongst the adults. But it's also just because I've grown as a person um, and as a follower of Christ. Um, I've learned a lot about how to pray, um, how to persevere when, when things get tough in this faith. So it's been a great experience in terms of my own spiritual development. With all of that being said, uh, I just want to say thank you so much for your support and for the way that everyone has welcomed me into this wonderful community, um, but just also the way that you've supported the youth of our, of our church, um, the future of our church, and, and invested in that in an intentional way, whether that's your time, uh, your energy, your financial support, your prayers. Um, I just want to express my gratitude um, for that and how much that means to our program. So thank you and I hope to meet many more of you very soon.